Yeah? Jody. Hey, it's, it's Ryan. Ryan! I was just wondering if you got my email. What, wait, what, what email? The one I sent three days ago. You know, I've, I've actually been having problems with my computer. What, what was the email about? Dinner, tonight, fancy restaurant. <laughs> anyway, it, it's too late now, so maybe another time? Shit. Shit, I'm so sorry. I... You, no, why, why don't you just come over here for dinner tonight? I mean, you wanted to see my apartment anyway, so... Uh, sure, but I... How about around eight? Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring a kick-ass bottle of wine. See you later. Now I get why you blasted my computer. You didn't want me to see Ryan. It's not your call, Aiden. I can do what I want. Fuck this. Fuck this! We're not gonna start this again. I'm not yours, Aiden. I can have a relationship with whoever I want. This is my life. Do you fucking hear me? This is my life. You know what? I happen to think Ryan is great. He's charming, he's intelligent, he's funny. And I think I'm fucking for him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm aware of what happened at the bar. Fuck you for reminding me. Ryan is not like that! Okay. Okay. It's seven o'clock. I have an hour to make dinner, tidy up, and make myself look good. I knew I'd have to learn to cook someday, but I didn't expect it to be so soon. I gotta find something I can make in one hour with what's ever left in the fridge. Asian beef, oh. I mean, that looks good. It's not too complicated. Curried chicken with oven-baked vegetables. It'll take some time in the oven, but it seems doable. Pizza delivery. I mean, it's not exactly gourmet, but it, it, no preparation, no mess. I mean, it could be an option. Asian beef. I mean, it looks suitably exotic. <laughs> as long as I don't manage to fuck it up. Thanks, Aiden.
So far, so good. Use a walk. Ginger. It's supposed to be an aphrodisiac. I mean, it's not in the recipe, but... It can't hurt. I mean, I need all the help I can get. Alright, add the sake for flavor. I think I'm beginning to like cooking. Ryan, you are gonna love this. Oh crap. Crap, he's early. I'm coming! Oh, good one, Aiden. Okay, you got me. Now, open the door. Aiden! Aiden, come on, open up! Too. You know, you're wasting your time, Aiden. You're not going to stop me from seeing Ryan.
Ugh. Oh, God. Oh, I hate this stuff. Books. Okay, on the bookshelf. Books go on the bookshelf. <laughs> okay, great. The trash can in the kitchen. Huh. Yeah, that's very funny, Aiden. Wow. 
Wow, it's very romantic. <laughs> Dirty clothes in the basket in the bathroom. All right, there. Oh, crap. <clears throat> Aiden, don't be a pain in the ass. I didn't behave yourself. Okay, this is important to me, and I'm counting on you. <laughs> uh, Chateau Margot, 2001. The guy in the store said it was a pretty good year. That sounds good to me. So. Why don't you sit? Um, I'll get the, um, the thing that opens the wine. <laughs> it's a cool apartment. Huh? Yeah, thanks. I didn't. For fuck's sakes. You want me to open it? No, no, I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> to your new apartment. To my new apartment. Oh, so when did you move in? Um, a couple weeks ago. Yeah, the agency found it for me and all the And how about you? Where, where do you live? Oh, I uh, have a place just outside of town. Yeah, it's small, but, you know, it's got a little garden. And did you, did you grow up here? No, no, I, I was born in Oregon. Uh, it, 
It's nothing. It's just... Aiden's messing with us. Ignore him. Ignore him. Um... How did you end up... I should probably... You know, I'm gonna go check on the dinner because... This cooking thing, it's a whole new adventure for me. <laughs> you need help? No, but why don't you go sit and more wine would be nice. <laughs> okay. Ah, Asian beef, right? Yeah. Is... No, I was sent to China for a year. I love Asian food. Oh, well... Do not get your hopes up, because this is probably the second time that I've cooked, and I would rather not talk about the first time. Mm. This is good. Oh. Good. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad you like it. So we've been working together now for what, like two years? I know mean, almost nothing about you. I mean, there's nothing much to say. I grew up with my parents on the DPA campus. And then Nathan looked after me. Yeah, your parents, do you, uh, are you still see them? No. No, I don't. I'm... sure everything's okay? Yes, everything's fine. Aiden is just... <laughs> he's just feeling a little nervous. It's okay, really. You know, did, did Nathan ever manage to explain to you why you have this link with Aiden? No. Jody, I, I think there's something wrong with Aiden. <sighs> Give me a second. I'm fed up with you and your goddamn jealousy. So why don't you just go back to whatever ethereal fucking place you came from and let me get on with my life? Get out of here! Do you fucking hear me? Get the fuck out! It's like... Is he here now? Um, probably just the, the, the dishes. I, mu I must have piled them too high. Uh, Aiden's not happy with me being I don't give a damn how Aiden feels. Uh, what about you? Do you have Do you have any family here? No. No, my uh, parents are still in Oregon. Fuck, Aiden! I need you to just stop! Listen, I... I better go. No, no, Ryan, wait! No, Jody, look, I... <laughs> Aiden's very possessive. I, I think you gotta work it out with him. Jody, look, I... We don't need to rush it. Hey, let's just take some time to get to know each other. Maybe I didn't wind up being okay with that. Are you happy now? You get what you wanted. He's gone and now you have me yourself. 
I really hope you're deliriously fucking happy. Why don't you just float around in your invisible world and watch me cry? I hate you! Do you hear me? I fucking hate you! <laughs>